Hey guys, Reserving here, and I just realized I forgot to do something. Uh, that's better. <laughs> Alright, as I was saying, hey guys, Reserving here. So, I am back with more of Disney Dreamlight Valley. So, last time when I was playing, it was, it was because of the Toy Story update. As it turns out, there is a third character added along with Buzz and Woody. I found out the next morning when I started a quest that was not listed in the quest logs. Now, I did see the character in the character screen, but that doesn't mean anything. Scar was there, like, almost from the beginning, well before he was actually there. Uh, this character has, however, been on, uh, on all of the loading screens so far, actually. So, uh, first started, again, uh, day after I did, uh, did the stream, I found a sock on the beach. That started the first of the hidden quests. I should mention, these quests are hidden. They are not in your quest log until you pick them up. So I took the sock to Donald, because it belonged to him. Uh, if you're wondering what Donald does with socks, he apparently uses them to wash dishes. Uh, then five days later, there was another one. That one went to Goofy. With each one, uh, you're getting DNA of this character. It's hard to figure out the character, because during the Donald one, Donald had found some kind of alien device, and he thought, saw stuff in the skies. Uh, it was telling people what UFOs, they did believe him because of Don's luck. Uh, but the first one, you got 33% DNA. Don had a an alien device with him, presumably from the UFO he saw. Second one got 66%, and it flat out tells you the third one, you're getting this character. <laughs> so, this is the third sock. It seems like it's every five days since you do the first one. I found this because I'm trying to finish up Buzz's final quest, which is annoying. Uh, alright. We're gonna track this one. <laughs> There's a sock to find out who this one belongs to. You might need to ask around. Talk to Mickey, Kristoff, and Merlin. Alright. Also, uh, something I found out that you think, considering I've been playing this since it came out for Early Access, is uh, when you do do the placement thing on a character, it will follow that character around. I wish I realized that earlier. Because <laughs> characters like to move around a lot. Sometimes, you'll have been where they were, but not where they are now. For example, I'm pretty sure Merlin was down there when I clicked on him. <laughs> this is your dream, you know. Only you can help. Alright, give. Well, hello. Well, now we have their rock. Oh. Goodness gracious, my sock. I've been looking for this everywhere. Really, this was the first one I picked. Okay. Oh. Dear friend, you conjured these for me long ago. They're my most cherished pair. I hold them close. Well, I can almost remember her face. Okay, I can guarantee that's a reference to something within Once and Future King. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Also, someone long ago or someone in the future, considering the way you age. Could you come and see me? Wait a moment. Looks like this sock has been a bit slobbered upon. Or is that something in this game as well? Oh, wait. If that's something in this game, that might be hinting at Fairy Godmother. It's space alien slobber. I'm positive of this. 
space aliens, you say? Hmph. going around stealing everybody's stuff and dropping it everywhere. You might have heard Dahl talking about it. But I... Uh, yes, I have heard going on about extraterrestrials of some sort. <laughs> we have enough magical muddles around here without worrying about that. So you think Dodd's quacking up the wrong tree, or have you noticed anything else going on? When I missing? tell Grimsby about this place, he's never gonna believe me. Uh, hi, Eric. Now you mentioned it, someone's been pilfering books and causing a great commotion in the Dreamlight Laboratory. Dreamlight Library. I said laboratory because it's a library looks like a laboratory. Maybe if I find a clue in there. I tip my hat to you, though I, I prefer not to take it off. Okay, so because I found <laughs> Myrtle was the first one I picked, uh, I don't need to worry there. Woody's quest I did get all the way done. Uh, Alright, remove trash in Merwin's library to find a clue. I'm going to do this one last so things don't get stuck. <laughs> like, I think there's enough space here now that probably wouldn't matter, but... Yeah, after the whole Donald issue that they had to fix, yeah. Alright. That clue in Mars Library, pick it up, done. Bring the mysterious clue to Donald. Of curiosity. The first one was an alien device, second one was a ball of blue fur. Third one is the mysterious quote. So, yeah, if you haven't figured it out yet, it's Stitch. <laughs> I should also mention, is mentioned that it's only left socks going missing, according to Goofy. Which is accurate to the film. <laughs> Alright, Donald, where are you currently? You're at your house. Alright. I didn't work with that. I forgot to do something. <laughs> Worst case scenario, a bit of this gets muted because I forgot to uh, turn that on. I don't know where the... Oh, there they are. Hmm. Nope, just missed it. Whatever. Did I get a... No, okay, that was the Moonstone one then. Alright. No, not enter... That is a legitimate issue that I really wish I could just target the character. Okay, that works. Don't come back. We're gonna get these items, yes. Oh boy, look at that. That's proof that a piece of cloth to come from a space alien. I'm not even gonna try to do a Don Duck voice. That was a strange device. You bet. It's beeping a lot. I'm gonna put the claw piece in it and see what happens. Yeah, so it's 33% each time. Now it's... So, like, considering that another 30% would put it at 99.999, technically. Right, what's it doing? Slow it up. The screen says DNA match. Authorization 100% complete. Please place beacon to initiate landing protocol. Keep clear for your own safety. What does that mean? It means this thing is some kind of homing beacon. 
put this down somewhere and then the alien ship will land. We can catch the sock stealing space alien. Smart thing, Rock. No, no doubt me the next time I see something suspicious going on around here. Let's put down Skull Rock off Dazzle Beach. Just be safe. That's actually where I wanted to put it anyway. That is amazing. <laughs> Um, Ariel, are you stuck on the turtle? Oh, I wonder if anyone here has a gizmo or a thingamabob. Alright, so we're gonna clear some space out before we do this then. It's interesting, this is the only, it doesn't be just the only area that has two of these. Trust me, I have checked. <laughs> I still suspect that Captain Hook is in Skull Rock, just based off of uh, previous information. Uh -huh. Obviously, take place after the movie, but with the memory loss, you might think you're still 626, huh? Aloha! Look! Charina! Stitch! Yeah, you make Stitch's ship crash? I forgot that Stitch actually can talk in full sentences sometimes, he just doesn't do it often. Didn't mean for that to happen. Oh. Probably oh. boogie. Ship is broken. Your fault. Your ship is malfunctioning even before it crashed. It looks like you're having some trouble steering it. Oh. Mega Otume. Ika Batuka. Thank you. I'm aware enough to know that those are alien swear stitch. At least a couple of them are. A blue alien hop out of a spaceship. I remember before forgetting. His name is Stitch. It always cause trouble. Even forgetting me more trouble than before. You know this means, Tom? We're right all along. There was a space alien in everybody's socks. I knew it. Never would believe me. It's the only one that figured out. Now you can brag about to everyone. I can't wait to show Uncle Scrooge that I was right. Don't fault in dragging to Mr. McDuck until we know for sure Stitch isn't going to destroy all the most valuable property in the village. Uh, I guess you're right. You have Stitch running around the village destroying stuff. Gotta catch him, but how? Oh, well, the spaceship got destroyed. I guess that was his only place to live. You seem pretty mad about it. We're gonna be talking to your uncle anyway, Donald. We can start by asking your Uncle Scrooge to make a home for him. It's a good idea. I always just can wreck his own house instead of mine. Oops, not what I meant to do. Uh, this is what I meant to do. Uh, so my plan is still to just do a uh, put it right in front of Scroll Rock. <laughs> also, is that? Oh, I guess I. 
didn't even notice that that came out. <laughs> We're also going to see, I've done some remodeling, because I've realized there's going to be a bunch of characters. I'm going to need to make space. So I moved some things around. I put Wally's truck near his garden. Uh... I wanted to put it here, but as it turns out, you cannot move the lakes. Literally the only thing you cannot move this valley <laughs> outside of herbs, which are because the herbs are just growing. So you can, so in those cases, you just grab them and move them. Well, technically, you can't move the ding spots either, but you can place stuff on top of them. So I've made a little downtown er area. The Christmas tree goes here because the Christmas tree goes with the department store. <laughs> so, Remy's restaurant stayed roughly the same place. Let's move over a bit. And then Remy's house is right next door. Hi, Scrooge. Good day to you. Hey, hello. I need to do something else. Thank you kindly. Oh, I need to place the house. I misread that. All right, no, that's easy enough. So my logical thought was because they mentioned there wasn't a place to live that I'd have to actually get the get some from Scrooge first. All right. Before I place the house, can I? No, that stays wherever the beacon was. Okay. This I can move, though. work. Okay. Move a tree first. As a general rule, I like to keep things there if I can. It's a personal thing. Alright. All right, Scrooge, how much? Good day, dear. Rock that we blew lad is ran muck all over the valley. Is he my destructive? The property damage. Ugh, my wallet aches just thinking about it. Gotta make him his own place that he can wreck as much as he likes. Okay, I thought it was gonna be way more than 10,000. <laughs> Mr. Rex, he doesn't wreck the valley. Splendid idea, because I thought of it. Hey, oh. That did not worry. I've done a trice. It's urgent, after all. I'm not going to try doing the close gush accent right now, either. I can do it. Not right now. Uh, nice work behind me. Find Stitch and tell him about his new home. All right, uh, find Stitch. Oh good, you're still on the beach. <laughs> Hello? You again. Be ah. oh. I built you a little something. Huh? Built something for Stitch? A new spaceship? It's something a little more permanent. A special place for you in the village. Hmm. Special place? Oh. Special place like home? Exactly. Oh, Stitch wants to have a home. Ah. I'm Rocky. You probably don't remember this place because of. Ah. I'm forgetting. Wow. It's to get dark by night thorns grow. Ah. Stitch going ship to get help for everyone. Uh -huh. I need fuel. Oh. So I come back. I think it's putting ship 
so ship go faster. What sort of things do you put in your ship? Lots of stuff. Socks, books, uh -huh. night thorns. And there's what the problem is. I'm trying to use night thorns as fuel. Where navigation was that messed oh. up. Yeah, ship control's not oh. good. The night thorns make head not good. Oh. So I got wow. lost. Well, you're not lost anymore, Stitch. Mm. Rock Achibaba? Oh. You my friend? We're all friends here. We're going back to Dreamlight Valley. Just promise you'll get back all those socks you took, okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah, promise. Agata. I wasn't expecting that. That's, uh... Alright, so we now have Stitch available. Stitch's Sock Stash. This chest holds some socks that Stitch took to use as fuel for a spaceship. Luckily, you don't think anyone will mind if you keep them as a reward. Yeah, that's going in the house later. <laughs> Stitch, what are Hello. your favorite items? I'm going to guess flowers are one of them. Probably food. So, what are you up to today? Oh. Stitch wants to surf, but can't swim. Should surf with someone. We know you can do that. Obviously, you can't swim because he's so dense. Will you fill in the water? He'll rescue you. Alright, surfing friends. Thank you. Honestly, I'd say, uh, since Lilo's not here yet, and for a record, I think that because this is made, game is made by Game Off, who did the Disney Magic Kingdom mobile game, uh, I'm pretty sure that any character that's in that game has a decent chance of being in this game. <laughs> and Lilo and Nani are in there. Bubbles is as well. Uh. Right, well, now, uh, so we can't do his quest till... Okay, his first one is level 2. Good to know. Uh, so pink bromeliad. I believe that's the savannah. Vanilla ice cream cone. That's just cooking. And a snowball. Okay, yeah, I can do that. That should be the pink bromeliad. I'm sure I mispronounced the name of the flower. I don't care. I'll see what's in the chest. Points. Alright. That's a tenth of white page Scrooge. Fifth, actually. Eat that for now. Alright, good. We have vanilla. Like I said, we're going to have to sell something goofy at some point, so. How's it going? still need the sand. Actually, I probably don't need the sand. I'm going to hold on to it anyway. Make sure I'm not to the ones that have the quest mark on them. I'm going to hold on to the spice. Uh, Alright. I accidentally sold with the with the quest mark on before. That was, a, was an issue. Alright. The wood's not hard to get. Actually, had 20 of uh, the Star Lilies, and I actually sold them. On to that, on to that. Alright. Mm -hmm. The 
Ooh, what did I get? Also, you may have noticed uh, I'm not wearing the dress that, that I had posted on Twitter. I made an ugly sweater. It's not perfect because there are still some quirks with the uh, design tool. But, since it's an ugly sweater, I also don't really care. <laughs> Laundry rock furniture, nice. All right, and maybe something I do decorating with, with later. All right, so vanilla ice comes in. I know I need the vanilla, which I got. I know I need the shaped ice. I want to say milk is necessary. Uh, let's see. I'm certain I've made it before. And sugar. Okay, yeah. Sugar I have. I also moved Buzz's RV down here because it just it fits here. Just his home absolutely had to go on the beach. No question on that one. Here, I don't remember how you actually get them now. So I'm going to do it the easier way. Cost might do it, but, I, but he almost always has them. So... I've got to move the flight back. But you know what? That, that works there anyway, so we're fine with that. Just need a snowball. Come on! I wonder where they harvest their ice. And let's see. Is Stitch still... Alright, because I got the furniture. Now, is Stitch still on the beach? He is not. Alright, where did Stitch go? Legitimately, where did Stitch go? There's Stitch. I know that works. Uh... My neighbors are good. Yes. Model Akuta. citizens. Can I give you? I knew I got extra points for doing it, and that knows going to do it that Linga! much. Linga! Goodbye. For you? You could really be anything. <laughs> We have so many fish, we need more diggers. Your bonus is based off of how many you have of each two, so it's like you do kind of want to have more than one in each thing. Like it's a, I believe it's a percentage based chance of your finding the extra thing. I'm not 100% sure how it works, but I know it's something similar to that. 
Stitch want coconut cake and coffee! Hat die Algorithm da keinen Bock? My name is Stitch! Really, but it's sad. Oh, what else do I, do I have to finish buzzes? Ah, there's something we don't know. Okay. I know for a fact that his uh, requirements are all of available. So I am curious to what the hidden requirement is. My guess would it have to be finishing buzzes quests? It's the only thing I haven't done. Either way. My name is Stitch. We're going to keep giving you the favorite items. Just need the vanilla ice cream, and there it is. Yeah, yeah. All right. I guess it's the there's only a couple things I can think to do. I might as well work on trying to finish Buzz's quest. Off chance there's anything in here. Oh, okay, good to know. chance when Leo eventually shows up they'll be in the same house. Uh it might also be a thing like Wally where I just have to do stuff and eventually I'll get whatever I need. Uh by the way I might as well finish up on Buzz's stuff. The Star Wars are going to be the issue. <sighs> so let's come up here and look. I'm also 90% certain that uh, the herbs count in the same spawn as the flowers. So I've been picking the herbs whenever I see them. I'm going to do this as well. Uh, won't be uh, another pass thing for a while, I don't think. And I finished this one. I thought it would be the hardest, so I almost have done. I hear something. I'm 
might also look just look it up in a bit because why not? This game where the where most quest stuff I I'm able to do on my figure out on my own, but every so often there's just something that I need to look up. Well, I figured out pretty quickly, it was just, you do certain things and you'll get stuff. So I just kept doing things anyway, which I've been doing anyway. It also helped that I was doing stuff for the pass at that point. I don't know why I did that, because I don't need that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I need to. <laughs> no, no, no. We need a better camera angle. Where is it? Is it... There we go. too fast. Alright. Oops. Let's try that again. I meant to do this. Um, why is that not working? Either way, I'm going to do that. Okay, I guess the UI has to be seen to do it, which is odd. There's no way I'm not saving that picture. Well, this is our hidden thing. <laughs> Dig it up. Yep, goodness level check. Show it to Donald, huh? Where's Donald currently? At his house. All right. I think I was just going to go into uh, the glade just to look for the flowers, and I have to see that. Doll, I found a sign with a picture of you in the peaceful meadow, but it looks like someone drew on it. Eh, what's the big idea? Who would, oh, I know who it was. Stitch. Does that again? I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Ah! How can I help? Hey, right, somebody around here wants to help me for a change. I'm telling everybody we have a stitch problem. Does anybody listen? No. What stitch do you get you so right up? First, you want to stop bothering me. Leaving teeth marks in my pontoon. Stealing the worms out of my tackle box. He asked me if I was ugly as a duckling. Uh, the last one is kind of Lilo's fault, huh? I think we have misunderstood Stitch. See, one of his favorite stories is the ugly duckling. He must understand anything. He's got in for me. Yeah. Put up those signs around the village to tell Stitch to keep out my favorite places. That's not nice. The village is for everyone. Exactly. I like sharing the village with everybody who behaves. The just doesn't behave. I don't even follow the signs. It's not at all. I drew fine pictures all over him. Maybe I can talk to Stitch and try to teach him to respect your property. Thank you. Stitch doesn't leave me alone. I'm going to fix up that spaceship his send to the moon. I'm going to assume the end of his the quest line is going to be fixing this the spaceship. I also suspect it's going to take a lot of materials. <laughs> Alright, 
Stitch, where are you currently? Oh, you're moving fast. I am definitely putting a tracker on you. Ugh. Trying. I am I'm very much trying, but you're not staying still. Hi. You don't know, having some misunderstandings? <laughs> I'm Mr. Stinks. Just do prank. Don't go why. <laughs> that was my funny <laughs> friend. <laughs> Friends, you're pranked all because you think it's funny when he's mad. Some people don't like to be pranked, Stitch. I don't think really upset. You have to respect his boundaries. Oh. Oh, may you stop bring Donald? Oh. Stitch's badness level too high. Of course not, you're just a little rambunctious. Stitch will do better, promise. Let me start by replacing those signs you drew on. Let's repair stuff. Let's go fix all the signs. We need to find hardwood, softwood, and those vandalized signs. Thank you! Alright. Softwood's extremely easy. My name you know what? is Stitch. Let's hang out while we're doing this. Softwood is easy, hardwood's a bit more annoying, but still not that that bad. Softwood. I said softwood was not going to be hard. Uh, it's almost certainly some up here. Sure is. This is the sense of the entrances, so that's a non-issue as well. I'll just go back there because we might as well use Goofy's uh, table to do it. So we have the 15 softwood, just some hardwood now. I'm actually not even sure I actually need any more of the hardwood for buzz. I just was keeping it in there just because it does say the uh, that's a quest item. Also, while I'm here. some hardwood. I think I have all of the wood I see. Because uh, they share the same spawns. So you pick up all the wood you see, better chance of what you need coming to spawn. Okay, that's definitely the copyright music again. I don't think it's gonna matter, but odd that turned back on. Thank you. 
often I find hardwood up here. Or is the turning off the copyright music just turn it off with the characters following? Because they, they usually have their themes. Which I'm actually not sure what Stitch's theme would be. It might be Hawaiian Roller Coaster Ride, but it might be something else. My guess would be Hawaiian Roller Coaster Ride. But I don't know for sure. Mother Goth of all people ends up with the. Uh, I've seen the light from Tangled because it seems that it's, uh, the theme is a, is a song from the movie, not necessarily a song of the character. Because I personally would have done Mother Knows Best. Don't have what you need, Foxies. Believe me, I'd love to, because I'd love to fill in the pet decks. at the very least finish one quest for Stitch. That's my main goal at the moment. Oh, I know. My friends, the trolls, would love you. There's also some hardwood in the glade. Sorry? Is that Wally? I said pick up the flowers I see. Uh... I also think the mushrooms might count in this area too, so I've been doing them just in case. This is not stuff I know, it's just stuff that seems likely, just based on stuff I've observed. And at a certain point, you just, you do just have to turn off the system for a while before stuff will spawn. grabbing these because you never know which ones will spawn in next. We have what we need there, so now it's just a matter of figuring out what counts as the entrance to Donald? There's one of them. I can just pick up that time. Fine. It's easier. And then have to be one Dazzle Dazzle Beach. I mean, we need to uh, to um. I don't remember what my own area is called. Ugh. Anyway, it's gotta be one towards this. I think there is. That was the 
the one that counted towards that. Alright, well, it's easy enough to just go around the borders, so... There it is. Okay, so that so that one counted as to um, okay, it's bump on me if I don't. The plaza. It's that simple. I for, couldn't remember what it was called. So this is the one for Dazzle Beach. All right. Give some of the materials to Stitch. What's this? This is some what we'll need to repair the signs. I should repair a couple of them at the crafting station, and then you can try fixing one yourself. Ah. Okay, so you'll be good at fixing and destroying. No, it's sure, why not? <laughs> I like saying we might as well just use goofies. Oh, there's a chest there too. Just need two of those. Also grab the chest one here. More moonstone. Now that I'm too worried on moonstones. Uh, if you basically if you finish the uh, The uh, higher tier of the uh, pass, you basically got enough to get the next one free. Uh. I'll get these items, yes. The signs I fixed. Let's fix, fix sign now. I think you're ready? Let's do this. Good job. Just be careful, okay? Mm. Taka. Mm. Oh. Looks to sneak better than before, yeah? Oh, you're uh. just the sweetest. I'm just gonna say it looks great. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go place these signs around the peaceful meadow. Show Donald that you can respect the space in the village. They count as far as so that's what I wanted to know. <laughs> Wrong button. Look, Stitches 1 is going over here. There. I'm roughly putting them back where they originally were. <laughs> Actually. And talk stitch. Here's the science, put them back. Stitch goodness level high now? Not quite. You still need to apologize to Donald. It's the right thing to do. Mm. Uh, you want Stitch to say sorry? Mm. Stitch's not good at sorry. Mm. That is true. <laughs> Don't worry. If you need it, saying sorry is easy. The most important thing is to... Say it from the heart. 
Okay, Taka. If I'm done, I say sorry. Oh, Alright, he's on his he's right off on his own because he's going to Okay, they're meeting right here. Ah, not you again. What kind of trick are you gonna pull on me this time? No trick. Just say sorry. Sorry? Now I know you're pulling a prank. Too smart to fall for it. No. No, no trick. Rock helps Stitch fix signs and helps Stitch say sorry. I'm sorry. I'm Stitch's heart bottom. Just like Rock say. Well, if this really isn't a trick, then well, I guess I forgive you for now. I'll keep an eye on you and you better not try anything again. Honestly, Stitch probably needs someone like Donald. <laughs> I don't know what that rabbit was doing. Donald likes Stitch is sorry, right? Uh. You did a great job. Ah. Keep goodness level high, promise. <laughs> I prank Donald sometimes. <laughs> no, don't prank Donald. Bad idea. I'm gonna keep you following if I can. Good, okay. I'm curious to what your next quest is. Another hidden requirement and... Oh, your, your next quest is available now. I just need to figure out what the requirement is. Okay. So, I remember saying before that one of the adjustments they had made was to Donald's tantrums. So what they said and what they did were two different things. <laughs> what they said was they reduced his tantrums. What they did, or I guess technically they did, but what they did was... The tantrums are shorter, but they now happen more often. <laughs> Which, personally, I think is hilarious, but not everyone's going to think that. <laughs> I'm really interested to work where your next one starts. Alright, how much do we have? 16, so I found one more of those, 11. Alright, it's going to take a while. And maybe I'll find Wait, out have you seen what the next thing oh, is while what? I'm going through. So I think a good rule of thumb is stitches are probably some kind of prank thing somewhere. Also, I really should check with Wally. It's near the garden, isn't it? Why is there a bit of play there? notification. It's subtle, but if you know what it sounds like, it's there. Just in case, I'm going to grab more of the, uh, the hardwood stuff.
I'm, I'm probably just hearing a whale. That looks like that might actually be one of the ones I need. Sure is. I don't have to misfulfill the main, but bugs me if I don't. <laughs> I'm gonna relate to Wally. It's gotta be. I have no clue if it could possibly be. It's possible it's something in Wally's house. It's like. Okay, so Biome Glove, Trust, and Wally. Those are the requirements. So it definitely involves one of those two things. Let's double checking something. All right. That's a lot of garlic. All right. And honestly, still too little garlic for me. I love garlic. I wonder where they harvest their eyes. So I'll look it up in a bit if I can't figure it out. Alright, this can sometimes be an issue, but no, we're fine for now. Alright. Sometimes you get stuck in certain characters' houses if you have someone following you. Solution is usually to just. I'm sorry? Well, it's definitely this. It just hasn't spawned yet. <laughs> That's right, it did have to do with the garden. Wally, can you move a bit over here, please? There we go. Yes, good chop cut. Wow. Hey, Wally, it looks like someone made a mess of your garden. I found this cop cup nearby. Ah. Uh, 
know who did this? Ah, ah, ah. Hmm, was it... Stitch? But uh Stitch messed up your guard? Oh boy. So I have to find Stitch and do a badness level check. Alright, well, Stitch is right here. Stitch, if you can follow me. Stitch, I just talked to Wally, and it sounds like you've been causing some trouble again. Oh. Trouble? No. Get this level very high. Stitch not feel good. Tummy hurts. Oh, you are hungry. You overate. Uh, so sleepy. You're sleepy? Why don't you take a nap? Nap? Uh -huh. No. Don't want to miss fun things. Blah. Stitch wants coffee. Ooh, Yep, that would do it. Mm. Take dirt from garden make coffee. Okay. Definitely not giving you coffee. Because I know how that ends. <laughs> no wonder you feel sick. Don't make coffee out of dirt. You need coffee beans. We're going to make him coffee. Yeah, yeah. Beans. I remember. Oh. For forgetting, beans grow on tree. Oh. Now, no trees, no beans. Oh. For forgetting, I put tree in spaceship for coffee to keep awake. Hmm, I think the sapling might still be alive, but it's in rough shape. I guess all the night thorns strangle its roots. I'll just nurture it a little. I'll bet I can whip up some coffee for you in no time. Good to talk to Wally about restoring the sapling to full health. Oh, really? Are we doing... Okay, so this is a new thing, then. I thought it was going to be, uh... Alright. Why Stitch is acting destructive? He misses coffee. Oh. If you just help us nurse this plant back to health, then Stitch won't be so tired and grumpy anymore. Uh oh. Ta da! What's this? A list of everything I need to know to plant the tree and get it growing again? Thanks. I'll go gather all this up and put it together at a crafting station. Meantime, if you just tend to the plant, I know we'll have it growing again in no time. I literally just need a sack. That's it. Okay, well, I need to make the sack. I've already done the ashes. I don't actually need those pebbles, I don't think. For, uh... Alright, I'm going to assume... Yes, alright. Fiber and soil. Well, we've got plenty of soil to work with. And fiber is easy. In fact, I probably have some fiber in the house. That's five soil, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Alright. Fiber is extremely easy to make if I don't have it. Uh... I definitely have some. Two. Need more than that. All right. So some soil in the house. All right. I can make fiber, so that's good. All right. How much fiber do I need? Whoops. Sometimes you mess with the menu too quick, quickly. Uh, something like that happens. We need fifteen fiber. We have two. That fiber is easy to make, it's just seaweed. So this should be good. Let's 
won't bug me if I don't do this. Talk to Wally. And you saw Merlin's outfit earlier. There's Mickey's. Now, I wonder if eventually they'll give Stitch his uh, space outfit, the space prisoner outfit. So we need to go have trust, so I assume we're gonna be planning it there. Okay, good. Ta -da. Oh thanks, Wally. Those are looking better already. Thanks for crafting stage with everything I gathered. And I wonder why I should plan it once it's ready. Oh, oh, ah. You're pointing to the Glade of Trust. That's a great idea. Comp there will help it grow in no time. <laughs> Alright, so this is going to be the way to day one then. Alright. I did the main thing I wanted to do. I got Stitch. We did do his first quest, so I'm happy with that. Sapling. And plant it in the Glade of Trust. My guess is it's going to work the same way the coconuts did, which, by the way, they did use the actual myth. You planted eels to do it. Uh... But uh, I guess this will work the same way, where once they're planted, the trees or bushes or whatever will just be available. I'm going to put it... Actually, right here is perfect. Now all I can do is wait. Sometimes... Okay, yeah, Be because sometimes when it's raining, it's hard to tell if you need to do it or not. You usually do. So, this is almost surely a way to day one, but for now, let's go look for some more flowers. So, yeah, I'm, at this point, I'm pretty sure... Anything Stitch is going to be involving destruction somehow. <laughs> Just in case. Yeah, I don't know if I'm right or not on this, but it's not going to hurt either. It's not going to spawn until I turn the game off. It's not going to spawn to until I turn the game off. Eh, it's not a bad thing. We got what we wanted. So, let's take Stitch to his house then. Because uh, I might as well get a screenshot for... For my YouTube thumbnail when this goes up there. It'll probably be a while after uh, the night stream. <laughs> oh, like a good long while. Oh. Ship's gone. 
I guess you really are going to fix the ship at the end, man, because <laughs> somebody took it. I was going to take a picture of him next to it. In this case... Stitch? You want to get a frame? There we go. Change the camera format. Oh my god, Stitch. That was... That pose is great. That'll work. So, uh, I think that's going to be it for tonight, then. Uh, I thought there might be a bit more, but, uh... Because I was hoping I could also finish Buzz's quest during this, but I think that's going to be it for now, because there's not much more I can really do outside of, like, redecorating stuff, and, like, that's stuff I like doing on my own time. So, this will be it for now. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Have a great time, wherever you may be. Bye, guys.